Hi everybody, welcome to Two OGs Hooking and Stitching Island Style. I'm Antoinette, your hostess, coming to you from Deer Island, New Brunswick, in the Bay of Fundy, Canada. Welcome to our returning fiber family. Welcome to New Fiber Family. And if it's your first time here, feel free to join the family. Just click subscribe below and click the bell all and hopefully you'll get notified when I upload a video or go live. Today is day seven of Advent. I'm a little late posting today, but I had to catch the early ferry to the mainland. It's raining here. It's, ugh. I mean, it's not cold, but it's just raining. And yes, I got my Christmas earrings. I got my Christmas vest, turtlenecks, even got a red and green bow in my hair. I'm just getting into the spirit, right? Anyhow, today is day seven. Now yesterday, okay, who did I open up first yesterday? While we're doing, let's, let's just think on that while we do the chocolate advent. Day seven. Here's day seven. Right here. And there's no day seven. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Probably falling down another day, so I'll get two, one, one of those days. So anyhow. Um, yesterday. I'm trying to think who. I opened up Christina's first today. Okay. And if I, if I got that wrong, I'm sorry. This is Christina's day seven. It says, keep in touch. Pretty paper. Ingrid, you're going to have all kind of pretty paper to make beads with. I'm going to have to get some of your beads. Maybe make some progress keepers out of them. Depending on what size they are, maybe I can make stitch markers. But I've got a whole bag down here for you. And I will put Ingrid's channel uh, in the description box. Right now, she's not, not feeling well. She's under the weather. But hey, go over and watch her videos. I know she would appreciate that. I'd appreciate it if you could do that and show some, some love. And if you're not subscribed to Ingrid, subscribe. And also, I have Christina's channel down below. Go subscribe. She's in Italy now, and she's got some great, awesome, great um, trips she's taking. I'm jealous. Ooh. Note cards. And they are maritime themed. So, my happy mail. Some of the happy meals will contain these. Thank you, me, Amika. Grazie. Um, everybody knows my colors, my what I like. Well, I love you guys too. So that was day seven from Miss Christina, and I watched hers this morning. And I've watched. I've been watching, trying to watch as many, <coughs> excuse me, Advents as I can. Cindy Hart's crochet, all of them, um, when I can. Um, I'm going live tonight at 7. I post it on the community tab and on the yayas. Lots of things to discuss. Anyways. And little sister got her box this morning. So I said, oh, you got some catching up to do. You got to do 1 through 7. So this is little sister Darlene's bag. Number 7. And she doesn't think her bag, her box is, wrap, is, is wrapped nice. She thinks it's just thrown together. Really? Have you you've seen the care that she took with all of these? I mean, stickers and wrappings. Oh, Rudolph can go there. And at day seven up here. So let's see what's in the bag. I'll let you guys see first. I can't see. It's wrapped. <laughs> it's wrapped. Yeah, your your bag just thrown together. Okay. Another Rudolph sticker. I don't think this one's gonna make it. No, nope, he's not going to make it. I'm going to have to cut this one so I don't. There we go. 
I hear Gracie outside the door. She's sniffing. I had to put her in her kennel today when I went to the mainland because the last time she made a mess. Chewed up Barb's knitting needles. Actually, they were my knitting needles. Ooh. More candy, candy, candy. Anybody want to come and share some candy with me? You know where I'm at? Call, I'll pick you up at the ferry. I promise I'd come pick you up. Oh, it smells so good. Her whole box smelled so good because I could smell like peppermint, chocolate. Yum. The Knitting Barber, the original. Oh, duh. Screws. She had given me one of these, and these are awesome. These, It's called the Knitting Barber, and these here, a couple ways you can use them. One, you can put them on the ends of your needles, you know, so you uh, don't lose stitches. The other thing is, you can use them as, if you need to take your knitting off, you can put your stitches on here, stitch holders. So that is awesome. Thank you. And a lot of times, I mean, I've got plenty of needles that I, I shouldn't have to. Um, it smell. It smells like burnt rubber. Um, cute little container too. Ooh, perfect. It's gonna have to go in my my little three bowl thing there that I keep all my like knitting notions in. Well, little sister, thank you very much. And heaven knows we have a lot coming up as far as my my. Uh, projects I'm trying to get finished, working the whips I am, and I have a lot to show. I'm um, actually what I did yesterday. Just I'm, I've just been doing little quick projects uh, as well as working on um, the other mitt. Oh, look at this! Look at the size of this. This is this is this is getting rather full. I might have to move to a plastic. Put this on a plastic bag for Ingrid, which is what I'm going to do. Hold on one moment. Okay, I'm back. Gracie was outside. I had to let her in. Then I had to put everything back that she pulled off the couches. And hubby got up. So, anyways. That's the advent for today. Hope you'll come back tomorrow for day eight. We've just finished the first week of advent. One through seven. And we still have 18 more to go. That includes Christmas Day. After this, I'll be doing a video because I got some happy mail. So I'm going to do another video. So I hope to see you at the live tonight. Um, it, it'll probably be an hour, hour and a half. Um, hubby has to get up at 4 a.m. And that means I get up at 4 a.m. So remember, hug, smiles, and happiness. Pass it on. Make the world a better place. Keep this good feeling this time of year, year-round. And I hope you're staying healthy, happy, safe, and doing what it is you love to do. Bye for now from Deer Island. And I'll catch you in the next video. Mm. Love you all.